Boudica. The Celtic warrior of the same name rules the Seni people alongside her husband Prasutagus. The king dies at the hands of the Roman soldiers, leaving Boudica's kingdom without a male heir, and the Romans seize her lands and property. This action film, released this past October 27th, 2023, is directed by Jesse V. Johnson and features the participation of Olga Kurilenko in the main role of Burika, Clive Standen as Presutagus, Peter Franson as Wolfgar, among other actors. For us, the story that is inspired by a true story from the era of the Roman Empire seemed interesting and entertaining enough to watch it until the end. But, even with a supposed dramatic content in its plot and action scenes, it did not end up convincing us completely. The story, in our opinion, is not well captured on the screen because it lacks emotion, it is lethargic with a weak script and anemic that does not convince you and is intermingled with generally average performances and with low-level special effects that give the viewer the impression of watching a movie made for TV, a B-movie, or those made for the direct-to-video format. In our honest opinion, they could have made a better movie. As for the production elements, we found the cinematography, costumes and settings to be good, while the special effects, especially in terms of the exaggerated use of blood in the action scenes, seemed average to us, as well as the choreography and montage of these scenes. The performances of the cast, including that of the extras, seemed mostly average to us, as we mentioned earlier. To be honest, Olga Kurilenko didn't convince us at all in her role as Burika, because she lacked passion, emotion and credibility in her character. In short, we found this production to be average in its entirety, which is why we give it a score of 2 stars out of 5. It's not a bad movie, but unfortunately, it doesn't rise to the level of being considered good. It's worth watching if you have nothing better to do. Until next time! Thank you.